So before we talk about Google Cloud, we need to ask ourselves, what is Google? So Google is an American multinational technology corporation headquartered in Mountain View, California, and its claim to fame was in 1996 when they invented the Google search engine. And so uh, the reason why this is such a big deal was that uh, prior to uh, Google, and really it didn't really take off until 2000, because I remember uh, when this thing came out um, where we saw mass adoption, but it was just that other search engines at the time, like Alta Vista, Hotbot, all the ones out there just couldn't do uh, a very good job of finding things. But Google uh, was smart that they would actually look at the contents of web pages, they would cache them, and that's how they would determine whether to serve view content. Another very impressive thing that they did was they didn't use high-end machines. They didn't have the money, but they had the money to buy up a bunch of low-end machines, and they created new technology to distribute, compute, and storage across those machines. And that technology is now open source, and it's called uh, Hadoop. Uh, and we'll talk about it later in the course, but uh, that is something that was very impressive as well. So the name Google uh, is actually a play on the word Google. <laughs> it's just a different spelling. And that word uh, precisely means 10 uh, to the power of 100. And so if you represent it out in this way, the idea was that you had a one followed by a lot of zeros. And so I guess this is Google saying, hey, we are a data-driven company. We work with a lot of data. And that's true, they do. Uh, Google is also an initialism for global organization of oriented group language of Earth. You can tell that they came up with the word Google and then they just decided to try to make it uh, into something, make it to something. So I know that doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but it's just, you know, they're having fun, I guess, back then. Uh, another thing we need to understand is what is a cloud service provider? So a cloud service provider, commonly abbreviated to CSP, is a company which provides multiple cloud services and those cloud services can be chained together to create cloud architectures. So here is a, um, a technical architecture uh, for GC and this is actually a web application. And this is a pretty standard one. So you might run your web app on a uh, compute engine, which is where your virtual machine is. You might have assets and things you need to store uh, into cloud storage, so this is like your files and stuff. You need a database, so maybe you need a Postgres database like Cloud SQL. Uh, you might have a CDN that sits in front of your web app uh, just to um, cache uh, commonly occurring pages. Uh, then you need a mechanism to actually deploy the application. So maybe you want to set all this up we deploy multiple apps, the same structure. So you can use Cloud Deployment Manager. And maybe you have a really fun uh, uh, or a very useful way of doing customer support by having um, a conversational AI like Dialogflow. So there are lots of applications out there. So this combination can get very, uh, very uh, variant. Uh, but this is a pretty common example, okay? So now the question is, what is the Google Cloud Platform? Well, this is what Google calls their, uh, their because they are a CSP, so uh, this is what they call uh, their platform, and it's commonly referred to as the GCP, uh, and also it's Google Cloud. So I don't know why, uh, but they don't use the word, like in their logos, they don't use the word platform, but Everyone knows it is Google Cloud Platform, and we all call it GCP. And the first service they came out with was App Engine all the way back in 2008. I don't remember them calling it Google Cloud at the time. I think it was just they wanted a way for people to be able to uh, deploy applications really easily. Uh, so it, I'm a little bit fuzzy about that there. But now, you know, when we look retroactively back, you can say, okay, App Engine was the first service they ever released. Uh, then there's also Google Workspace. Uh, and you're probably familiar with this uh, because everyone got their Gmail uh, over 10 years ago. And so G Google Workspace is just a rebranding of G Suite. And so it's a bundled offering of SaaS products for team communication, collaboration for an organization. So there you got Google Calendar, Gmail, Google Meet, Google Drive, Google Sheets, Google Docs, Google Slides. And you know this course isn't really about Google Workspace or the G Suite. But you know, it does overlap because when we talk about identity, getting access to your Google Cloud um, uh, console, things like that, it can tie into Google Workspace. And so that's why uh, I'm mentioning it here and you're gonna see it uh, mentioned a few times in this course, okay?